Google Pixel Watch 3. It's a wow. Hello guys, I hope you are all doing great. We are back. The Pixel Watch 3 is going to have an improved watch unlock functionality with the USB connectivity upgrade. And here's more information about it. If Google maintains its autumn refresh schedule, the next Pixel Watch release is still probably months away. However, 9 to 5 Google has been progressively disclosing information about the Pixel Watch 3 series, such as the fact that it will come in 41 mm and 45 mm diameters, and the same website has now discovered what appears to be a hardware upgrade over the Pixel Watch 2. Supposedly, Google has added ultra wideband or else UWB support for watch unlock within the Play Services app with the following strings you guys are seeing now. So according to the website, Google will automatically deactivate UW and regions where the technology has not received approval, encompassing most post-Soviet states, Indonesia and Nepal. By the way, we've been here before with UWB support and the Pixel Watch series. Before the smartwatch was even released, there were rumors that the connectivity standard would be included in the Pixel Watch 2, but these were quickly squashed by the FCC certification documents. This time, it appears that the feature is at least being developed for Pixel Watch 3 models, as evidenced by the appearance of fresh references to UWB connectivity within the Play Services app. As UWB connectivity is faster and more dependable than Bluetooth, the functionality is currently anticipated to replace Bluetooth when using Watch Unlock. Regretfully, further information about the Pixel Watch 3 is currently unknown. But when the Galaxy Watch 7 series debuts this summer with a one UI themed version of the same underlying software, the smartwatch will probably be the first to ship with a stockware OS 5 experience. In addition to that piece of news, according to a recent report from a typically trustworthy source, Google's upcoming Pixel 8a could cost a lot more than any of its predecessors, at least in the European region. German retailers have now revealed that while the Pixel 7a retailed for 500 euros, the Pixel 8a will cost 570 euros, which is 70 euros more than the 7a while two versions will be available, one with 256 GB of storage and the other with 128 GB, the later one running 630 euros. According to internal listings from German retailers, sales of the Pixel 8a are expected to begin in four colors, bay obsidian, mint and porcelain. However, since the 256 GB model is currently only available in Obsidian, not all colors may work with both storage options. According to earlier leaks and rumors, we can expect the release of the Pixel 8 A in April or May and it is expected to come with 8 GB of RAM and Google's Tensor G3 SOC. Compared to its predecessor, it will have a much more rounded design and the now iconic Pixel feature of two rear cameras housed in a visor that spans the entire back of the phone. For the moment, that's going to be all all about the Pixel 8a? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below as well. If you guys are new here, be sure to subscribe. The tech chat is over and I am out.